I love the quote that says, blessed are those who can laugh at themselves, for they will never cease to be amused. <laughs> we do need to learn to laugh at ourselves and not take ourselves too seriously. Uh, having two sons, I've certainly learned that through the years. When our youngest son was in the seventh grade, he came home one day and told me that the sister of a friend of his who was a teenager was going to get a nose job. And I said, really? Does she have sinus problems or breathing problems or does she just not like the way her nose looks? What's the story? And he said, oh mom, it's real sad. She has a great big bump in her nose just like you. <laughs> One time at the holidays, I bought a dress to wear to a holiday party. And it was a little different from what I usually would choose. And so I brought it home and I tried it on for my boys to see. I said, well, never a good idea. You're right. So I learned. So I said, well, what do you think? One of them said, it's too sparkly. The other one said, it's just not you. And I said, well, you know what? I get tired of being me. I want to be glamorous and sophisticated. And our oldest son said, mom, let me just say, it's not the right kind of dress for a middle-aged lady who's got a lot of gray hair. <laughs> this was before I became chemically dependent, okay? <laughs> One of my neighbors was going out to take a walk in the neighborhood, and it was right about this time of year when the weather was just beginning to warm up, and so she decided on this day to put on a pair of shorts before she went out on her walk. Now there is always that moment, isn't there? When you put on something that you haven't worn in about a year and you ask yourself, is this really a good idea? <laughs> so she was headed out the back door and just as she was going out, her teenage son was coming in and she made the mistake of asking his opinion. She said, honey, do you think that my legs are just too pale for me to wear these shorts to go out walking? Her son said, mom, it is not the paleness <laughs> of your legs that I would worry about if I were you. He said, it's the hail damage on your thighs. <laughs>